Uh, let's go to the phone lines. I believe we do. We have Mary on the line from Mobile. Yes. Hey there, Mary. What is your question tonight? How can we help? Hey, Mary. Um. Hey, Bill. Um. My question is, um, I live in an apartment complex, and I have to come up 16 steps uh -huh. up to get into my apartment. And um, I have gave the office a letter, two letters, one from my uh, from my primary care doctor, and one from my pain doctor where I should be moved downstairs. I'm not supposed to stair climb. I'm on social security disability. Okay. And they, and they are yet to acknowledge that. I've asked them and told them, and I brought them letters, I think, twice already. Okay. And they still have not done anything. If I was to follow on these steps, I was told that I would have a huge lawsuit by another attorney, but they don't do slip and falls and, and accidents. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, I would say um, that that was... Um, probably bogus advice that you got from that other attorney. Um, if, if you have a fall now just because they haven't, uh, you know, accommodated you with another apartment, um, if you have a fall now, I mean, maybe you can make some kind of an argument, but I would not uh, rely on that at all. Uh, because again, it's gonna go back into how, you know, how the accident occurred and this and that. What I would tell you, and this is probably something you don't wanna hear, but if they're not being um, responsive to you, you need to just go somewhere else. You need to, you know, for, for every apartment complex that, you know, uh, uh, you know that, that will take you, there's a hundred uh, standing right behind that will take you. And so um, I, would not, I would not bank on the fact that if you have a fall, even though you've been telling them this. Mm -hmm. um, now, if this was a broken step, or water dripping down on the stairs or something like that where there was a defect then yes um you know i mentioned earlier about the uh, the two apartment complex cases that i have now involving air conditioning uh cases or, or uh, units um, my clients wrote they went to the you know they, they did everything and um they did not well, they tried to come and fix it but in the middle of the night on both occasions the, the clients got up to go to the bathroom, they walked down the hall, lo and behold, there's a huge puddle, they didn't see it, they didn't know it was there, and they suffered major uh, uh, injuries. But, so, but if it's just because your back is um, in a poor condition and you're on disability, but if there's not a defective condition with the steps or something of that nature, then I would say you would not have a claim on something like that, but you just simply you need to keep asking them to move you on the bottom floor, and if not, I would, you know, as hard as it sounds, I, or uh, sounds, I would go somewhere else. All right.